First of all, how long the symptoms have been a problem for? Um, well, they've, they've got worse. They've been a problem in, in this uh, event for about three months now. Okay. Yeah. And prior to that, I mean, when was the first time you noticed a problem at all? Oh, four and a half years ago. Okay. Yeah. And then you saw your GP, I think, I, first, is that right? Well, I didn't do anything for about two years. I thought, well, this is getting old and this is what happens if you're a bloke and so on. Yeah. Uh, so then I did go and see my GP about two and a half years ago. And um, he's put me on some medication and um, that seems to have worked so far. But it's, like I say, over the last three months or so, the symptoms have got much worse. Okay. And do you remember which medication you're on? Um, there's one... Um, Full muscle, full no, 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 there's full is for um, keeping the prostate down, yeah. and there's another one for sort of smoothing it. Tumusolin, tumusolin. That's right. Yeah, yeah. confusing yeah. names on there. Ah, so I think the one is the finasteride. I think you're quite right. Is the one to help shrink it down. Yeah. Uh, the other one was tamsulosin. Is tamsulosin, that the one? Tamsulosin. That's the one. Yes. Yeah. I'm sorry. I no, no, no. These names. That's all right. And how long have you been on those particularly? I've been on those for two years. Okay. Yeah. And initially, did you find Initially, it? fine, yes. In fact, the, the symptoms sort of went away slightly, and um, it was manageable, and that was fine. But as I said, the last three months, I, I don't know, it doesn't seem to be working so well. Okay. Can I ask a little bit about the actual symptoms again, then? Sure. So, you mentioned already about getting up at night, yes. and that's gotten worse. That's got much worse, yes. As I say, it was once or twice a night, now it's two, three times a night. Mm -hmm. Three times a night, more often than two. Yeah, yeah. And the stopping and starting, sort of getting yes. going. Getting going, you know, you stand there, come on, come on. Um, it really does, it seems to be taking much longer than it did, say, six months ago. Sure, sure. And then, you know, it's sometimes, a, well, the pressure's very low, it's a dribble, to be honest. Yeah, uh, yeah. And then, has it stopped? Has it stopped? Has it stopped? Again, you know, you obviously don't want to be having an accident, so you stand there for what seems an eternity to make sure yeah. you are finished. Yeah. And if it gets unfinished, um, you're on your way back to bed and you think, and that's, that's getting worse. Okay. Do you ever find you have to go back again very soon after actually finishing? Yes. Uh, within sort of an hour or two? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And during the daytime, I know about night time you've mentioned, but during the daytime, are you going more often as well? Yes. Yes. It's, um, I would say the average is about every two hours. Okay. I can go for four hours, um, you know, if, if pushed as it were, but I'm not very comfortable. Going for that length of time, not popping around a bit. Um, but so it's about every two hours. I mean, I can imagine that must be a bit of an inconvenience, obviously. Well, not it is an inconvenience. Go out and things. Yes, we like to go to the theatre sometimes mm -hmm. uh, and the cinema, and you know, you've got to sort of, is the film just sort of sort of dash in then and then mm -hmm. the interval, and yeah, it can be inconvenient, yes. Yeah, yeah. Can I ask also a little bit about sort of when you actually do go, mm -hmm. is it painful to actually pass urine at all? No, I wouldn't describe it as painful. No. Okay. And have you ever noticed any blood actually in the urine? Has it been a pinkish colour or, or a red colour? No, I've never noticed that. Okay. Okay. Now you also mentioned a little bit about the sort of being tired as well. Yeah. Which I think you're wondering if it was because you're getting up three times at night. That would seem to be yeah. the, you know the cause of it. I, I, that's, you know, I do feel tired, yes. And, uh, I do go back to sleep, but I don't seem to be. I don't wake as refreshed as I used to. Sure. And your sort of weight? Can I ask if you've lost weight or gained weight? Anything changed? Yes, I have lost a little weight. Yes, um, I do go up and down a bit. I don't know if, if uh, I seem to be in a down period at the moment. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Do you, any idea how much weight you've lost or over how long a period? Um, yes, I have a rough idea because we have scales. Um, I think I've probably lost about three or four pounds over the last couple of months. Okay. But you said it's not unusual for you to fluctuate a little bit. No? Not unusual. No. Okay. Well, bear that in mind. Um, I mean, is your appetite still good? Are you still oh, eating yes. well? Oh, yes. Excellent. Yes, I think it's excellent. Good. good. That's what I think is excellent. <laughs> yeah. Do you get sort of bony pains or joint pains or aches that you don't normally experience? Has that been happening at all with you? No, it hasn't, no. Okay. Okay, very good. Well, look, if you don't mind, uh, just to summarise then, so the waterworks I know have been going on for a couple of years. Yes. Uh, your GP put you on some tablets. Yeah. Uh, the two tablets. Um, Things then sort of seemed better initially, mm -hmm. but over the past couple of months have worsened again. Exactly. Is that fair to say? Yes. And particularly sort of getting up at night, mm -hmm. but also still going during the daytime as well, yeah, which is more frequently. often yeah. a nuisance yeah. for people, isn't it? Yeah, and also the stream's not very good, yeah. flow's not great. Okay. 